Seahawks After Dark, The Evolution of Midnight Madness is an exhibit highlighting this tradition at the University of North Carolina Wilmington, then and now. It can be viewed at UNCW Randall Library during normal operating hours. Midnight Madness honors the start of the UNCW basketball season. It was first held in 1990 and has become a popular annual event. Historically, players could not legally take the court to train until midnight of the approved day. To give players more time to practice, in 1971, the University of Maryland started practice at 12.03 a.m. This quickly spread to other universities and became a solid tradition within 20 years. Midnight Madness at UNCW was held again in 1991, but then stopped until 1996. Two years later, in 1998, the name changed spelling from Midnight, N-I-G-H-T, to Midnight, N-I-T-E, to avoid copyright infringement. Other events were added in later years, such as the Fan Jam in 1999, that originally started out before the main event. In 2006, former student Adrian Strain organized a Trask Trek that allowed off-campus students a chance to come together and celebrate. NCAA rules changed in 2012 to allow men's teams to practice two weeks earlier than before, but did not include the women's teams. UNCW celebrates both teams at the same event, so our Midnight Madness tends to stay around the original date. Today, after a few rule changes, a name change, and the addition of other campus-wide events, Midnight Madness has evolved to become a week-long celebration for men's and women's basketball. The exhibit showcases photographs and other objects from Midnight Madness history, such as banners from the late 1980s and early 1990s, t-shirts from past Midnight Madness events, and a basketball signed by men's head coach Kevin Keats. Seahawks After Dark is on display from October 12, 2015 until February 5, 2016, and can be found adjacent to University Archives, Randall Library Room, 2008. It is in an exhibit case in between Honors College and University Archives.